Okay, the time is 6.35 p.m. The Louisville regular session of the Planning and Zoning Commission is now called to order and we do have a quorum present. This is a Zoom meeting. I'd like to welcome anyone that's listening uh, on the dial-in or listening uh, through Zoom. There are no public hearings for this session and the applicants, uh, if they're on either Zoom or line, uh, if you need to speak, raise your hand function and someone will uh, visit with you. When calling in to uh, Zoom in the beginning, all your phones, uh, all your microphones will be muted. So if you need to speak, you need to unmute it. And if you called in through a landline or through 800 number, and you want to speak, it's press the star nine button and then that'll raise your hand and someone will uh, talk to you. Okay, we do have a quorum present. The first item is approval of the minutes of the April 21st, 2020 meeting. Are there any additions or corrections? If not, may I have uh, a motion to Approve as presented. Karen Locke, move to approve. Okay, motion by Karen. I second. Second by Aaron. Now we do the roll call vote. So we'll start over here. Um, Mary Ellen? Aye. Karen? Aye. John? Aye. William? William? Uh -oh. Aram? Aye. Aye. And William I. So uh, that was what? Uh, six uh, confirmed. No opposed. Item number three is a consent agenda for Platts. It is a, uh, item 3A, <coughs> excuse me, preliminary plat for villas of Bel Air edition. It contains 102 residential lots, eight open space lots, and seven private street lots, and it's on a 9.06 acres. It's out of the Eli Pickett survey, the abstract number is 1014. It's zoned plan development, townhouse two, which is PD-TH2 district. It's located, <coughs> excuse me, at the Northwest corner of Bel Air Boulevard and Southwest Parkway uh, slash Oakwood Lane intersection. It's a portion being replat of the lot two Oakwood West edition. Yes, uh, Commissioner, so this is a preliminary plat um, for a zoning project for the Villas of Bel Air that was approved back in 2017. Um, there are no new variances being requested with this preliminary plat. That is in conformance with the plan development zoning. Um, and there are actually two fewer lots than were originally planned for in the subdivision. Staff's recommendation is uh, approval of the preliminary plat to allow for preparation of the final plat. Okay, may I have a motion? Move to approve. Move to approve by Mary Ellen. A second. Seconded by John. Those in favor, oh, well, you gotta go to the roll call again. Uh, Mary Ellen. Aye. Okay. Karen. Oh, she must have, I saw her say aye. Um, John. Aye. William. Aye. And Aaron. Aye. Okay, motion carries, all votes are aye. Item number four is a regular hearing for a flat. This is 4A is a final flat of Castle Hills, track Q edition with lots one R1, four X, five and six. It is on 0 0.86 acres. It's out of the W.J. Bonner survey, abstract number 122. 
with general business to GB2 and a state townhouse ETH zoning designations. So located on the north uh, of King Arthur Boulevard and Morgan Lafay Lane intersection, being a replat of Castle Hills Track Q, Edition Lot 1, Block A. Commissioners, the final plot of Castle Hills Track Q, Edition Lots 1R, 14X, 5 and 6 was submitted on April 6 and has been reviewed by staff. Staff recommends disapproval uh, with the following reasons based on the chapter 6 and 17 of the Louisville Code and also the 1996 Castle Hills Development Agreement. Um, we, um, the deficiencies include that the title block needs to be updated, plan summary table needs to be provided, uh, correct certification of ownership and city signature block needs to be provided. Also, um, they need to show the correct building setback and the zoning, set, um, zoning designation setback. Um, Staff recommends that the Planning and Zoning Commission disapprove the final plot of Castle Hills Track Q edition uh, with deficiencies enumerated above and delayed to staff the ability to accept and approve the flat plat once the listed deficiencies are corrected. Okay, thank you, June. Are there any questions? If not, then may I have a motion on item uh, 4A, final plot Castle Hills Track Q. Motion to disapprove the plat with giving uh, staff approval to uh, approve once the deficiencies are corrected. Okay, motion by William. Second. Seconded by Karen. And the roll call is Mary Ellen. Aye. Karen. Aye. John. Aye. William. Aye. And Aram. Aye. Okay, motion carries by six, uh, unanimous. Item five, other business. Uh, following this is a transportation board meeting. And I guess we go to another website for that. Correct, so there's a, a separate link on the transportation uh, board agenda. Uh, it's also in that other business on this agenda for anyone that might be watching and wishing to participate in that. Um, so once this meeting is adjourned, if everyone could open the transportation board agenda and click on that link, we'll go ahead and get that meeting started. Okay, I guess we're probably looking at 645. That's about 10 minutes or five to 10 minutes. All right, I may have a motion to adjourn. Move to adjourn. Uh, who said Mary that? Ellen. Mary Ellen said that, all right. Um, Karen? Second? Aye. <laughs> okay, Karen seconded. Um, now, uh, roll call, Mary Ellen? Aye. Karen? John? Aye. William? Aye. Aram? Aye. Okay, meeting adjourned.